Hi, welcome back to Math Smash. In this video, we're going to look at dividing integers by unit fractions. Okay, so we've got 3 divided by 1 quarter, and we can see that in the top bar we've got 3, and 3 is made up of 3 ones. So we'll put the ones in there. Okay, and each one is going to be broken up into four pieces. Why? Because we're dividing by 1 quarter. So we're going to have four one quarters in each of these one each of these boxes so okay and now we just draw one quarter in each of these boxes okay and i'm going to do the same thing for the other two boxes but i'll do it a lot faster there we go. Okay, so now we just count up how many quarters we've got. We've got 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that means that 3 divided by 1 quarter is 12. That means there's 12 1 quarters in 3. Okay. Next one. 3 divided by 3 quarters. Again, we've got 3 in the top bar. 3 is made up of 3 ones. Each of the ones is going to be cut up into quarters, but this time we're going to put them into groups of 3 quarters. So uh, let me just get each of these quarters drawn in here. Okay, so now we're putting them in groups of 3 quarters. So there's 1, 2, 3. That's one group. And 1, 2, 3. There's another group. And one, two, three, that's another group. And then one, two, three, there's another group. So how many groups do we have all together? We have uh, one, two, three, four. That means that three divided by three quarters is four. That means there's four groups of three quarters. Another way of doing it is three divided by three quarters. We can just multiply the three times the four. Gives us 12. And then we just divide that by 3 and that'll give us an answer of 4 okay next one 6 divided by 2 thirds okay we've got 6 in the top bar and 6 is made up of 6 ones all right and each of the ones is now going to be cut up into thirds that means there's going to be three pieces okay so I'm just going to finish drawing in the one thirds here now we're putting them together in groups of two-thirds. Okay, so we're going to get two one-thirds put together in groups. So there's one group of two-thirds, another group, another group of two-thirds, another group of two-thirds, another group of two-thirds, and again, and again, and again, and again. Okay, so how many groups of two-thirds do we have? We've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've got nine groups of two-thirds. So another way of doing that is six divided by two-thirds is six times three is uh, there, divided by two. Going to give us six times three is 18. Divided by two is going to give us nine. There you go. I hope you found that helpful. Join us again.